Five minutes into the season two premiere of Shrinking, grumpy octogenarian therapist Paul, Harrison Ford, tries to avoid a difficult conversation with his colleague Gabby, Jessica Williams, by turning on the car radio and singing along to the outfield's 1985 banger, Your Love. It's a direct callback to the most talked about moment in season one. Harrison Ford sings Sugar Ray, but Shrinking wants us to know that it's evolving. Hell no, we're not doing that today. Gabby scolds, switching off the radio and returning to the topic Paul so wanted to avoid. In season two of the feel-good comedy, starring Jason Siegel as a therapist who tries radical honesty with his patients, everyone is forced to confront some hard truths in hopes of learning to move past them. Based on the seven episodes, out of 12, made available for review, Shrinking is ready to let its characters roam beyond the boundaries of its initial high-concept premise which results in some satisfying and funny self-actualization. The new episodes pick up shortly after we left off 18 months ago. Widowed therapist and father Jimmy Laird Siegel is finally in a good place with his teenage daughter, Alice Lakita Maxwell, but his new style of therapy has not been without its consequences. After pushing her abusive husband, Donnie Tilkey Jones, off a cliff last season, Jimmy's patient grace, Heidi Gardner, is languishing in prison. And Jimmy realizes that he's blurred the lines between friendship and therapy with his patient Sean, Luke Tenney, a young veteran with PTSD and anger issues, and it's keeping him from making real progress. Jimmy's office mates have their own issues. Paul frets about being a burden to his neurologist-turned-girlfriend, Julie, Wendy Malick, as his Parkinson's progresses, while Gabby is forced to admit that she wants more from her no-strings-attached relationship with Jimmy. Created by Siegel, Bill Lawrence, and Brett Goldstein, Shrinking spent most of its first season letting Jimmy's adventures and misadventures in no-filter therapy drive the story. It's a fun hook, but not a particularly sustainable one. And in the new episodes, Lawrence and company have the confidence to delve deeper into all the core characters' issues. Jimmy's best friend, Brian, Michael Yuri, panics over his fear of parenthood after his husband, Charlie, Devin Kawaka, raises the idea of adopting a baby. Gabby clashes with her sister, Courtney Taylor, over how best to handle their elderly mom, Marla Gibbs, and her failing eyesight. Alice has a lapse in judgment that upsets her best friend, Summer, Rachel Stubington, in a standout turn. And Sean has no idea how to cope with long-simmering resentment toward his father, Kanadran Bentley, after the two of them unexpectedly reconnect. The writers struggle a bit more to settle on an arc for Liz, Krista Miller, Jimmy's bossy, Batinsky neighbor. Her story begins to gel around an idea, one I'd tentatively describe as ill-advised, by the midpoint of the season. So far, the biggest problem with Shrinking Season 2 is how much time it devotes to the Jimmy Gabby situationship, which felt more like a throw-it-at-the-wall plot device in Season 1 than anything worth exploring further. This time around, the fallout from their friends with benefits hookups seems designed to generate conflict rather than character growth. I am so bored with this shit, groans Paul, after another tense interaction between Jimmy and Gabby at the office. Everyone is correct. Otherwise, the new episodes deliver plenty of the dynamics that worked so well in season one. Gabby and Liz's deepening friendship, based on truth-telling and making fun of Jimmy, Paul and Jimmy's reason versus emotion antics, and Ted McGinley, as Liz's affably zen husband, Derek, with anybody. The scene-stealing actor has a bigger presence in season two, including an all-too-brief moment with Ford. But frankly, it's not enough. Shrinking does occasionally aim straight for the tear ducts, but the series excels at leavening heavy moments with ridiculous humor. C. Jimmy arguing with Paul after losing two of his front teeth. I did not make a myth take with Theon. He is my biggest success story. Siegel can make the pronunciation of a single word funny. His twist on undergarment is a hoot, and his outstanding co-stars flourish with their expanded screen time. No one throws a tantrum like Yuri, and Williams has perfect comedic and romantic chemistry with Damon Wayans Jr., who joins the cast as Derek's friend, also named Derek. And yes, co-creator slash writer Brett Goldstein also makes several appearances this season, but Apple TV Plus would very much prefer that I not tell you who he plays. The role is about as far from Roy Kent as he could get. Listen, man, triggers are everywhere. Jimmy tells Sean in the season premiere. You can't hide from your past forever. 
It's foreshadowing, of course, for Jimmy and pretty much everyone in his orbit. This season, though, Shrinking reminds us that hard truths are usually no match for hope. Grade B+.